Hey there Libra, this is Deborah, Deborah Claire Channel Guidance and guys this is going to be a brand new series. Decided to do this for you as a thank you for all your support for the channel over the last few years. Um, this is going to be in addition to the readings I put out for you guys, okay? This is going to be looking at energies for the weekend coming and for the next few days into a new week. So let's see what's going on, let's see what's going on, hope all you guys are well. We're going to be looking at three cards for you, three cards for your person. This is the person that you are in a relationship with. This could be somebody you've got your eye on. This could be a lover, right, Libra? <laughs> okay, guys, so let's see what is coming through for you over the next few days. Okay, here we go. Thank you, Archangel Michael, for joining us. This is going to be a reading for Libra. What do my lovely Librans need to know, please, Michael, over the next few days? Thank you. See what's going on, guys. See what's going on. Okay. Michael's asking me to cut. Let's do this. Here we go. Three cards for you. Three cards for your person. And let's check out the overall energy. Okay. Using the Psychic Tarot deck by John Holland. Let's get into this. So, Archangel Michael, what is the overall energy, please, between Libra and their person? Between Libra and their person? No, that one. Okay, Michael, that one. All right. Okie dokie. Moving into Kipper. All right. Michael, energy, please, between these two people, between Libra and their person. Yeah, Michael's asking me to cut the deck. Here we go, guys. Okay, top or bottom, please, Michael. Top or bottom? Bottom. Okay. Ooh, three wanted to come out. Mm, okay, let's see what's going on. So, let's have a look at the energy that you're sitting in, Libra, at this time. Oh, world completion. Some of you are going to be traveling. Some of you will want to go and see loved ones, um, somebody in particular, right? Or somebody here is dealing with completion. Now, if this is your energy, you might be completing a relationship, okay, and moving swiftly forward into a new cycle. There could also be extensive amount of communication over the World Wide Web, okay? Maybe you're online dating. That's what this is representing. So, Libra. Second card for you, oh, the sun in reverse. This card has come up a lot. So maybe you're walking away from a situation because there's just no enlightenment. Or maybe for some of you, you're ending a relationship with a Leo and they aren't very happy, potentially. Um, this is also in the upright, very much a card of moving forward with happiness, success, victory, positive energy, okay? Um, so maybe with no enlightenment on a situation, not bringing you into your happiness, you've decided to end something, all right? Maybe there's just very much a clouded energy that you feel with you and somebody else and you've decided enough is enough, I'm not waiting, I'm moving forward. Next card, my goodness. Seven of Cups in reverse. Now this is clarity, or this is you realizing that you don't want any other options. You just wanna be with one person and maybe you are deciding to head off in a new direction, maybe concentrating on other things rather than love, Libra, at the moment. Maybe you're realising, if I can't be with this person, there's no clarity, there's no enlightenment, I'm just heading off in a new direction, I'm concentrating on me. Okay, so Libra, let's have a look at your person's energy. Mm, we've got temperance in the reverse. So Libra, if you're not thinking about the Leo, then you might be thinking about a Sagittarius. But this is very up and down energy. This is somebody who feels very unbalanced, not quite sure what's going on. But this can also be somebody who's been treading water for a while, Libra, wanting to figure out what you're going to be doing. And they are getting super impatient, okay? Mm, wanting to get the show on the road. Hmm. So, nine of cups in reverse. Your person, Libra, feels as if the cups are empty. This could be also somebody who's unbalanced because they don't want to get into a third party situation. 
This guy is holding a big glass of wine. He's feeling very happy with himself. There's a bit of a smug look on his face, right? Um, but he also wants to, because he also wants to pick other options. This is somebody who's very happy because he's got his cake and he's eating it. Now, your other person, Libra, if you're in a commitment, your other person is deciding, I just don't want a casual fling. I don't want a casual affair. I'm going to walk away from this because as far as I'm concerned, the cups are empty. Maybe they have moved out of the energy of treading water. Maybe now, because of unsettled energies, they're deciding to head off in a different direction. So Libra, if you really want this person, then you've got to get your act together because this person is getting impatient. They are nearly ready to give up the ghost. Okay. Mm. Yeah. With the Knight of Pentacles in the reverse, you could be connected to an Earth sign, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. But whoever this person is may be feeling that you're holding player energy. They're feeling as if you are not coming towards them, offering them any kind of stability. They may well be pulling back their energy, getting impatient, deciding I'm not going to wait any longer. It's not happening for me. I don't want to fling. I'm moving forward. OK, so looking at the overall energy between the two of you. Choose wisely. Someone here may be taking their time because they don't want to take a leap of faith and a risk with the wrong person. Maybe somebody here has a lot of other options and they're just trying to decide who they want to be with. But somebody here, Libra, your person, maybe the person that you really want to be with, is fed up with waiting. They are wanting to sort things out. They're wanting to move forward. They may well decide they have to walk away. OK, maybe you've been taking too long making a decision. Mm. Yeah, somebody here is moving on. Somebody here is leaving, not waiting any longer. This is also completion for you, Libra. Maybe the other person has wanted you to move forward towards them. Maybe to give up a third person and you're not doing it. You're not making a decision and they are heading off in a different direction. Interesting. Keep a deck. Let's have a look. We have pathway. Some of you are very clearly moving in a different direction. We have a lot of travel cards here, guys. The world is travel. So is the energy of the sun, potentially. And of course, we have travel shown here. Some of you are moving in a different direction. You could be relocating, moving to a different city, a different state, a different country. Maybe there's an issue here with long distance. We have a lot of water shown here. So if we're not talking about an emotional situation, we could be talking about a long distance connection and someone here is not waiting and they are moving forward. Yeah. Maybe you, Libra, are trying to see the true path ahead for you. We have an energy here sat in a lot of stress, despair, fed up. I don't know what to do. Three and two, Libra, is a challenge. Somebody feels very challenged in the situation. I almost feel that somebody here has been waiting, wondering what to do. And somebody here is ready to give up the ghost. OK, looking at maybe moving in a different direction. Last card, message of concern. Now, you could be getting a message of concern, Libra, that somebody here isn't happy, somebody here is ready to leave, or you could be the one passing a message of concern to somebody else. There's something that this person is really stressed about. We have two fives, four and one is five, three and two is five. This is a very challenging energy. Somebody here is maybe getting a message from someone that they are thinking about moving in a different direction. There is stress, there's anxiety, this is overthinking what's going to happen in the situation. But I'm feeling that somebody may be sitting in the energy of taking too long to choose either to relocate or to move towards someone. There's an energy of despair, somebody's getting impatient, there's no enlightenment, there's no happiness in this. We have the world, travel or completion. Somebody here, your person Libra feels as if the cups are empty. There's no forward movement. They're getting impatient. They've been trying to tread water, waiting maybe for you to make a decision. And they're no longer waiting. They're sitting in despair, but there is a new pathway open. And somebody's just about ready to walk down that path. So Libra, challenging energy for you guys. I hope you guys are okay. I'm sending love and light your way. Many blessings. And I'll be back next February next February, next Friday. Oh, Michael's saying the 23rd of February. Michael, interesting. So maybe something is going to happen on the 23rd of Feb. I'll leave that with you. 
sending love and light your way and i'll be back next friday bye then libra take care